never thought I would be so happy to see this screen, but I am, because I ran Disk Utility, uh, tried to uh, repair the disk, verify the disk, said it couldn't be repaired. Um, for whatever reason, I went to reinstall Mavericks OS X and uh, got a message saying the disk was locked. Went on the internet, somebody said something about mounting or unmounting the drive. I unmounted it and then I had nothing, um, like nothing. I couldn't even select the startup disk when I tried to exit disk utility and uh, it shut off, turned it back on. Um, I did a repair disk not on the Macintosh HD volume but the Toshiba main hard drive whatever and it ran a, some kind of a repair disk on that and at least I was able to select the Macintosh HD as a startup disk so this is where I am back here sort of at square one but at least my files are still on there which is um, the main thing so Let's just let this run through its course and talk about replacing the hard drive and just using this externally to get the files off. That's it for now. Well, let's just see what happens here after the progress bar. I'm sure it's going to shut off because uh, when I tried to run disk utility, it said that uh, disk couldn't be repaired on the Macintosh HD volume. I will try reinstalling OS X Mavericks from Disk Utility again and just see if the drive is still locked. And uh, if it is, it's uh, off to the computer store to get a hard drive. SSD, of course. stop this and start it again to see what the final result is. Okay, so it shut off again, so let's try the disk utility, reinstall Mavericks hard drive, or uh, reinstall OS X one more time. first time I did this there was a EFI disk and then the Macintosh HD over here but we're back to nowhere to install it. Go into disk utility, bing bing bing. 